Shoe Boys 123 here, and I've decided to make a new list on my top 10 shoes that I want as of the end of 2013. So, this list is just my personal opinion, and I know it's going to get some hate, but I don't even care. So, without further ado, let's get into it. The first shoe on my list, number 10, is going to be the KD4 Christmas, so we'll be right back there. Um, the reason I love this shoe is because of like the brownish red color that the shoe has, and it's just so wearable. And it's comfortable. I have KD4s. They're comfortable. They're easy to wear, as I said. And it's just an all-around great colorway. So number nine is a pack, actually. And it's the Nike SB Hemp Pack. The reason that I love the Hemp Pack is also because of the wearability, but also the materials used. I know it was made for National Weed Smoking Day, but I don't even care about that. I just like the uh, blue, the blue Nike SB Hemp, and then the red Nike SB Hemp. The green ones are a little too limited with only 420 pairs made, so I bet I could get the those two hemp pack, the two pairs out of the hemp pack that I want for about $200 each, maybe a little less. Um, Alright, number 8 is the Dornbecker 9s. Um, the reason I love the Dornbecker 9s is because that gold and gold and white it possesses and on the soles, how it has the green and red which is taken from the Mexican flag. And the Dornbecker Charity, obviously, that Nike does is just a great concept. Number seven is the Nike SB Concepts Ugly Sweaters. I love this shoe, even though the price point was insane. Um, if I could get the black ones for like $250, i would be happy, even though it's probably not going to happen. But the grays, they were general release, so I could cop those. But let's get into the next one. Number six is the... LeBron 10 EXT pack, not excluding the corks, you have the denims, mints, and hazelnuts. Out of those three, I prefer the hazelnuts, then the denims, then the mints. The mints I weren't really feeling, but if I could get them for a nice price, I'd just get them to complete the pack. I don't have any right now, but I will probably buy February. Alright, the next shoe is number five, the LeBron 7 red carpet. I know you guys don't know much about the shoe, but because it's an older release, but it's a I think a blue, red, black colorway. And it's just like I just love how the colors blend into each other and it just makes the shoe very wearable and very stylish. So number four is the Nike SB Concord. It's this is my favorite SB of all time. I just love how Nike took a Jordan and put it into a Concord and the colorway is killer with your I love that leather, the black leather that pops with the white mesh. And then you have the purple on the bottom of the translucent Nike SB sole, which is insane. Space Jams, I weren't feeling as much, a little too much leather. Alright, number three is the Jordan DMP pack. This is my favorite pack of all time. I love the sixes. I love sixes, my favorite Jordan. Um, and just the gold and the black, just in like the Concord with the Concord 11 with the gold jumpman just makes it the shoot the pack all come together and they're insane. I'm hoping to get those, but I think a little too much money. I know a kid in the town over that has them, but he's not he doesn't want to trade them. All right, number two are the Carmine sixes. I love the black and white on this shoe. This is just a wearable shoe. I know Nike's retroing them next year, at least it's rumored, and I want them so bad. They're just an insane shoe. I mean, they were going for like four hundred, five hundred dollars on eBay, which I'm not. I don't think I'll be doing anytime soon. But you know, prices are prices. Number one, Lightning Fours, all-time favorite shoe. Insane colorway. The yellow. I know they they were going less than the original Thunders that released in '06, because the Thunders retailed for five hundred dollars. And the Lightning retail for 225, but now Thunder price has gone down. Lightnings have skyrocketed, one thousand dollars. <laughs> they're one thousand dollars, and all around great shoe. So guys, please like, subscribe, and comment your opinion on or your top ten shoes that you want to call. Thanks guys. See you around.